And now a page from our Sunday morning almanac, September 9th, 1942, 76 years ago today. The day the United States mainland came under enemy attack during World War II. For that was the day pilot Nobuo Fujita firebombed a forest near Brookings, Oregon. Launched from a submarine off the Pacific coast, Fujita piloted his small plane to a spot just north of the California border, as he recalled years later. The mission scared the daylight out of me. I did not think I would come back alive. He dropped two incendiary bombs, neither of which touched off the massive fire that was hoped for. And despite his fears, he did make it back alive. Twenty years later, Fujita made a return trip to Brookings, this time as a guest at the annual Azalea Festival. I did not know how people would react to me. I thought they would throw stones or eggs or worse. Though some objected to his visit, no objects were thrown, and he presented the town with a samurai sword as a gesture of peace. Nobuo Fujita paid other visits to Brookings before dying in 1997 at the age of 85. His sword remains on display at the Brookings Library, while his mission is remembered nearby on a very special Oregon Trail known as the Bombsite Trail. <laughs>